Hi, it's Barb, me. Welcome back to my channel. I'm running out of space. I still haven't gone ahead and moved everything I needed to off of my cell phone that I filmed from. So I've got to make this really, really quick. <clears throat> if you're new, thank you for joining me. My channel name is B-Rex, the PR Goddess One, also known as the Glamazon and the Beauty Horde, the Hot Mess. Beauty Horde's upstairs, book Horde's down here. Today's going to be a book thing. It's going to be quick. If you're a return viewer, thank you very much for coming back. If you're new and you like what you see, be sure to hit subscribe and notifications because I don't own an upload schedule. So I was just going to go ahead and show you my like Evolve Mala bracelet and my lovely work wellness deck that I got courtesy of... The former hometown Montclair Book Center, which is a beautiful rare book place. Love it. And I got them through abebooks.com. They're in, like the Amazon of used book people. you got to check them out. But I just got myself this book. Okay, this book is uh, means a lot to me. This book, uh, my mother had this same exact copy. This is from 1979. And I read it to pieces. I literally broke her hardcover spine. I literally must have read this book as a child starting as soon as I could read on my own and probably age four, like for like adult books, not like kiddie books. I read this book in its entirety at least 300, 400 times to the point where I destroyed the binding. So as an adult, I always wanted to get another copy, but it's out of print. The original uh, print for this book is, according to this in here, Life Magazine photos are from 1956. Original print is from 1979 of the book. So I found this book used. I didn't think it was going to come with the, the, the jacket, first of all, because I've seen it without the jacket even in libraries. It said it was in good condition. Okay, I bought it for $4.56 on ABE Books through one of the other used booksellers on the network. So it came with the jacket. It's in perfect condition almost. Just a little rip on the corner of the jacket. So it has all the photographs and everything. But imagine my surprise. Now the author is William Hoffer. I open this book and it's got everything I remember. Except this one is an autographed copy. I got an autographed copy for four friggin' dollars. Make my week. Make my week. Go ahead changed my mind that I'm having a great week so this is what I did I took my little lunch break I was gonna lay down because I've been battling dizzy spells this weekend no 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 I went and I got the mail because it said that my mail came and I knew I had a bunch of packages and I was expecting this guy today and now I'm gonna heat up my leftovers and I am just gonna smile you know what I don't even want to touch this book now I already read it 400 times I know up down and sideways what happens nobody's gonna touch it I'm gonna put it in the case it's autographed author's probably deceased by now I don't care. I'm keeping it. And if you like what you saw with Barb losing her mind over an autographed book that most people didn't even know existed, be sure to leave me comments. Leave me emojis. You've made it to the end of my video. I'm so very pleased. And for those of you who are actual friends and subscribers, you already know from Life with Barb how much this book has shaped my life and how much I love this book. And I know it's sad because it sounds like I'm like all happy about a tragedy in the ocean, but it was actually the opposite of a tragedy. Yes, 50 something people died. However, the last time there was this kind of a major T-boning event, Empress, RMS Empress of Ireland, uh, other ones, you can just look them up. Almost everybody on board died because the ship sank within like 13 to 18 minutes. So this is the only time that they've had such an accident where pretty much everybody who wasn't crushed where they actually collided lived. That's amazing. That's why I love this book. This book is about humanity defying the odds. So if you can find this somewhere, get yourself a copy, whether it's to read on digital, take out from the library, buy a copy if you can. Maybe they'll bring it back into print. I can't say that Mr. William Hoffer is still alive. I haven't looked him up. I'm assuming he's dead because it's 2022. And this book was around when I was a little girl. And I'm in my late 40s. So yeah, yeah, it'd be like that, dog. It'd be like that. So now let me sign off, come down off the adrenaline high. I gotta call my mama. She's gonna love this. This was her book. Oh, I'm not giving this one to her. I'm gonna have to find her another copy, but you get the idea. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, I feel like I won the lottery. Creepy chow kiss. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay clean, stay kind, and stay out of trouble.